Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, my name's Lauren. I want to just start off this vlog today. It's Friday. I just put on a self tan. So, I don't know if you can tell. Maybe a little bit. My neck is, yeah, a different color than my face. But I painted my toenails, gave myself a pedicure. I don't really paint my nails and I literally run with boy hands. It's fine. I haven't gotten my nails done since I think March. I don't know. I just come, have come to the conclusion where like I can paint my own nails, my like own toenails and be fine. But every few months it is nice to just go and get your toes done. And then I get my nails done for like special occasions. You realize how much money you save not going to get your nails done all the time. It's crazy. I haven't gotten my nails done regularly in two years. So you just, you save so much money. It's not like a necessity. It's not like a need. I'll do it for special occasions. Maybe eventually I'll go and get my nails done regularly, but they grow so fast that I would have to go like every week and a half to get them done because they just don't, they grow so fast. Like I have to trim my fingernails. I trim my nails every week. So anyways, so I just gave myself a pedicure. I am actually traveling in like a few weeks, the end of August. So I'll probably treat myself to a manicure and pedicure before my little vacation. So looking forward to that. But it's Friday. I just did all that stuff. Christian's about to be home from the gym and I think we're cooking steaks tonight so that will be yummy we get our steaks from trader joe's and the trader joe's center cut fillets are really 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 good tomorrow i kind of want to lay out by the pool and get a base tan i really need to get a base tan it is the middle of july and i have i self tan every week and that's just it's starting to get to the point where i've self tanned every week for a year and it's it's starting to become like a, a chore. So I kind of want to get a base tan. And I know it's going to take a few weeks for me to get like a good base tan. So I might lay out for like two hours every Saturday until I go on vacation. Just so I have something. You know? Do any of you have a base tan at all? Or are you like me and you don't have time to have a base tan because you work? And then you relax on the weekends or you're doing stuff and you just haven't had the time to create a base tan yet summer is almost over we're losing that chance so anyways i'm gonna make myself one of these let's see i like drinking out of these double walled cups Can't wait for Christian to get home and make fun of how my face doesn't match my neck. We're about to begin cooking the steaks while well, Christian is. These are the sides that we're doing, green beans and the gorgonzola gnocchi. This is such a good side with steak. I'm not kidding. We probably pair this nine times out of 10 with steak. So good. But we're gonna try cooking it on the grill tonight. We usually cook it on the cast iron skillet. So we cook it in the pan and then we put it in the oven. Tonight we're gonna try it on the grill. Not for an hour. <laughs> <laughs> 
Christian always tries to shower around the same time as I do because we have a glass shower now and it has a glass door so you have to squeegee after you shower each time and he's always like he just was like I'm gonna shower right now but I'm not gonna squeegee because you're about to shower right and I was like no this, this tan has got to sit for another hour he could not get out of squeegeeing but anyways I'm drinking so what I started doing is mixing my apple cider vinegar with the spindrift so i mix like a tablespoon or two with a raspberry lime spindrift of apple cider vinegar this is the kind that i use this is the apple cider vinegar that i use so i've been mixing it with spindrift and it's not bad this is how i have to watch tv with a tan on i have to use a big blanket so this is how i sit with a tan on I just basically veg out right here and wait for my tan to be okay to wash off I use a three-hour express tan so that's why which is better I like it more than sleeping in a tan personally yeah, it just it stains the bed it's just a mess so if you have found a tanner that doesn't transfer to your bed sheets let me know and if it comes in an express tan, let me know too. I'm making our favorite breakfast, which is the Trader Joe's hash browns with avocado. Sorry, Christian's on the phone. And two um, runny eggs on top, or like a runny egg on top of each. And it's so good. But every time I cut an avocado, I have like this fear because Christian's sister is a, a nurse, works in the hospital. And she said that the most common cut or the most common like ER is for people who slice their hand cutting an avocado. So every time I cut an avocado, I get extra scared now. I think we're gonna go down by the pool and tan. I was sitting on the balcony for an hour with my legs in the sun. So I kinda wanna go down to the pool and get a tan today. coming back from a pool day and showering washing your hair putting lotion on I don't think you can tell that I got a tan because I have a fake tan on so any tan that I probably got I won't be able to tell until my tan probably washes off putting this face mask on and I probably won't rinse it off I never really rinse this summer friday's jet lag mask this jet lag mask is just so good i'm gonna brush my gloves i'm gonna put like an extra layer underneath my eyes probably won't do my hair because i think we're gonna go to the pool again tomorrow and christian and i are both trying to work on our base tan christian is cuban and italian so he has a one-up on me i am irish 
So I don't really tan easily and my skin tone, like I burn instead of tanning, so. It's 8.30. We're just gonna do something easy for dinner and cook this pizza. So I'm preheating the oven. And I've never tried this before, but it's probably good. Just something easy. So I didn't do my hair because I think we're gonna lay out by the pool tomorrow. A few hours ago, Christian and I played chess and it was competitive. It was a good game and I won. So just wanted to update. That's what's going on. I'm doing laundry. About to switch it and then hang up the clothes and fold it and everything, and then switch it over. Okay, I just got home from running errands. I went to the bank to deposit some money, went to CVS, got some tanning products because I think we're gonna lay out by the pool again today and. Taylor and Maya are coming over too. And then I needed to get more of my favorite cleansing balm. And I picked up more dry shampoo. This is my favorite dry shampoo, so. And then I went to the grocery store, came back, made breakfast. I also got this from the grocery store, which I've never tried before. The La Colombe coffee, the oat milk one, and it's vanilla. I didn't want to abruptly end off the vlog yesterday at dinner. Like that was my last clip, I think, because I don't think I vlogged any of the rest of the night. Like we went to get ice cream and then we watched like a Netflix show. I don't think I vlogged any of that. So um, I definitely wanted to end off this vlog. It's Monday. I am starting my work week. I have to go prep my breakfast and lunch and leave for work soon. But I just wanted to end up this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys had a great weekend and have a great week. And make sure you're subscribed. Give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.